Man, everybody, there's been a lot of new stuff coming out right now. So I'm going to be doing a lot of quick videos just with quick little updates about a few projects and then introduced in to some new stuff. And this first one I'm going to cover is an announcement that I saw today on the Soul Farm Discard. So if you're into Soul Farm, make sure that you're in their Discord and I'll have a link in the post so you can join up because they're very cool to talk to here. It's still pretty mellow. There's not that many people here. You can see the main dev here contacting with us and, and putting out these updates. And one of the big things is that Radium is finally going to embrace them and embrace the Tulip token. Now Radium should have done this sooner because Soul Farm is an AMM for the Radium Farms and it makes it so you can get a lot more APR. So if you go ahead and you look at these AP, I mean, you can get a, a lot big APYs. So you can get these daily APRs that are pretty huge, some of them over a percent and even a daily APR of like th a quarter of a percent is pretty crazy. You got weekly ones and then when you look through these yearlies here, you got the STEP USDC and I'm going to be doing a deep dive on the STEP platform in one of my upcoming posts because it's actually pretty exciting. And so this pool, I'm so glad I got into it early. It's kind of funny. I put $200 into this and I only have 233 even though it's been going up with this really, really big high APY but that's fine with me because I'm getting a lot of step tokens and I'm someone who thinks they might be worth a little bit more in the future but let's get back to the topic here of the updates that have been going on on soul farm so you might see here now I covered the fact that the tulip token launched but they did something different they were automatically sending these tokens to our wallets but they understood that some people like me who only have small amount of money on Solana were not earning very many of these tokens very quickly so we might not want to be getting micro transactions sent to us all the time and that can bog up the system even though Solana Soul Farm is on Solana and Solana has a huge throughput. Projects should be responsible to not try to clog the network. So now you have to claim your tulip tokens. So if you look right here, I'll have a harvest button here and I can claim 0.02 tulip. And that's pretty cool. But recently, if we jump back to their Discord, you'll see that the tulip price has shot up. It's now at $18. And one of the reasons why is maybe people are finally seeing the power of a governance token to an AMM because you're gonna be able to help decide what other projects get their pools put into this. But it's also because there was a big announcement and I will click on it here and we'll go and read it on Twitter. And that's that Soul Farm. Oh, no, wait, this is the one that they got their Telegram group back. <laughs> Everybody can go ahead and join that one. Oopsie. Let's go ahead and click on this one. Radium is finally going to be adding a Soul Farm fusion pool to their platform. With Radium being one of the top um, DEXs and yield farming sites in all of Solana, and really the most powerful one, in my opinion, next to, next to maybe the Serum DEX, the, this is a big uh, thing to see because it really shows that these two projects are going to be working together, that they're going to be friendly, and that there is no longer like this worry that maybe somebody else is getting some of the rewards that Radium should be getting for their pools because really AMMs are very helpful for any yield farming project, and it's really good if you can get listed into them. Oh, I'll go ahead and follow them. I didn't realize I wasn't. So tomorrow on June 7th, we're going to have the first Tulip USDC fusion pool added to the Radium pool. And here's a little guess of mine that isn't confirmed yet, but I'm guessing we're also going to end up with an a Tulip USDC pool here in the AMM platform. So theoretically, You'll be able to put your you'll be able to come here to the fusion farms on radium. You'll be able to stake your tulip tokens that you're earning with some USDC into a pool here where they'll be earning more tulip tokens out of I don't know the APRs yet. We won't really see those until it goes live and we see how much money really gets dumped into there. If you're in there early though, you have a chance at earning some extra tulip tokens. So maybe be looking to get into the pool early if you want to. And then you'll be able to eventually, in my mind, stake them over here where you can have it being uh, compounded into more dollars in Tulip while possibly earning a little bit of Tulip on the side if they stack an APR on top. So this is pretty exciting stuff to see the Soul Farm platform. You know, we got into it, we're still early, it's still beta. They're still, you know, 
don't ham into this with all of your money because we all need to make sure that we're responsible with how much that we put into any one project until we have researched it and fully and understand it fully on our own. If we go back to their homepage, you will see that they don't have anywhere in here anything that says audit, at least not yet. They are going to be working on that, I'm sure. And the team is kind of anonymous. They're here, but we don't know exactly who they are. Now, I've talked to the co-founder here a few times in the Discord. He's been really honest with me. He's worked with me, and they have even donated me a few tokens after I did some videos. So they didn't hire me to do the videos, but they saw that I put them out there, and he did give me a few tokens. I did want to let you guys know that. In total, I received 10 tokens for two videos. This was back when they were worth a lot less. I held on to them, so yay for me. That was a nice little bonus. But I am going to continue to follow this because I am dipping my toe into Solana and Solana yield farming because I want to be in here and be early. And if Soul Farm is the pancake bunny of this site and their token is going to grow to being worth hundreds of dollars, I want to be earning it. And if Radium is the pancake swap of Solana, I want to be on that platform. And so now I am. You, you will see that the, if we go here to the vaults, I'll just let you know the ones that I'm using. Now, if you go ahead and in short, um, get connected, I'll get connected. I don't have a lot of money. I was showing you guys I have like maybe almost $700 in here now. Um, that's because it's been growing. I put in a lot less. If you, if you short by the APYs, you're going to see most of them are going to be kind of the smaller projects on the Solana chain. If you want to go for crazy earnings, these are tokens that probably haven't proved their worth yet. I don't even know what all of these projects are yet. Uh, Media, Frida, Merck. I know what the oxygen protocol is, so that one, but see that that one gets down into the, you know, more normal 200 percent these few that are in the thousand percents are almost a thousand percent these are these are newer projects are projects with really high rate of issuing their token that's what's going on with step and that's why this one is so high but it is decreasing daily and so this apy used to be up in the millions now it's in the six thousands and eventually that apy is going to get down to a more reasonable level and then you're going to be glad that you had a lot of tokens in my opinion because i'm going to be showing you that platform later on but Let's go ahead and show you the ones that I'm investing in. I have the Ray Serum pool because if you're going to be on Solana, the Serum Dex is one of the major ones. So you should have a little stack of those. And the, Ra the Radium uh, protocol is one that I want to go ahead and get more tokens of. So I just have these in here, auto com compounding in the AMM and just earning me more of those tokens. I also have another Ray Solana one because I am using that platform more. So I don't mind the idea of having my Solana tokens and my Radium tokens go ahead and grow and grow and grow and grow. And they're both growing at pretty aggressive percentages for pretty established projects. And then I went ahead and took a chance on the Step USDC one because when I first did my first video, it was such a large amount of money. So this is really where I'm going to end this one. I just wanted to let you know that pretty soon on Radium, we're going to be having a fusion pool here with the new Tulip token with USDC. So you'll need to get ready if you want to get into it tomorrow. I'll be putting this video out today really short, shortly and you'll be able to get in quickly and start earning some of those rewards here on the Radium platform. I do think that this does put a little more backing behind the Soul Farm project. I'm sure the Radium team wouldn't add the pool and put it on their platform and feature it in their fusion pools if they weren't confident that the team was here and working towards things. One of the things I do know and we'll be finding out if they did well that Soul Farm did take part in the hackathon that is coming to an end. So hopefully we'll have some new announcements coming out about some exciting things. Hopefully also we'll see this um, eventually this AMM grow outside of the Radium platform and maybe offer us the ability to go ahead and stake some other tokens once some of the other sites get their own farms up and going. All right, everybody, that's it for today. Thank you for checking out my channel. If you want to keep up to date with things that are going on with Soul Farm, with Radium, and even with Matic, because I'm getting into Matic, and I'm not running away from Binance Smart Chain. I'm spreading myself kind of thin, and maybe that's not the best thing to be doing, but I do want to be able to cover all of these different farms and bring you some exciting information on them if I find anything that is really cool. Thanks, everyone. Bye.